America today, there is so much hurt and pain and anger. More than 100,000 lives have been lost to the pandemic. 40 million people and counting have lost their jobs, and as a result, their health care too. And last week, George Floyd's murder by the brutal force of a Minneapolis police officer's knee ignited rage and protests all across the country, as well it should. While the headlines may be new, the underlying issues are not. And we have a president in Donald Trump who is unfit for office, who disgraces the country, undermines our values, fuels divisions, and displays cruelty and immorality in his words and deeds. But important as it is that we defeat Donald Trump on November 3rd, the change we need goes far beyond that. It's going to take all of us, together, to demand policies that get workers the wages they deserve and Medicare for all, because health care should be a human right. It's going to take all of us to counter racism, to show that black lives truly matter. It's going to take all of us to ensure that our government deals with climate change as the existential threat that it is. And it's going to take all of us to protect and defend the rights of our neighbors, regardless of race, age, ethnicity, religion, sexuality, or gender identity. For all of us who care about creating a more just and a more progressive America, there's so much work to do. I hope you'll give me the chance to keep leading the fight on June 23rd.